Hi and welcome back to Makeup 440 Plus. So I'm just going to finish the rest of my face using some products from my hauls and yeah I thought I'd just do it all in one hit, save doing it in my other video when I did my eyes which makes that video really long. Um, I've had these for a while, this is the Hermosa Rose um, Illuminating Powder in from um, Milani and I absolutely love these not only are they absolutely beautiful to look at but the color that they give to your skin is beautiful so I'm already done this side of my face so I'm just going to run some of this through my temple and my hairline and then do that fabulous 3 and E which I've done on the other side just to give my face a bit of color and a bit of shape so I've already done that on this side so um, we should be pretty right there then the next product I am going to use is something that I love and I think I put it away no I didn't there it is is the Lorac Tantalize um, with the, the bronzer and the highlighter just beautiful now I know I've seen a lot of people um, a lot of the makeup gurus using the NARS brush I actually got this brush in and I don't remember which but in a um, in a bronzer or a blush and I actually love it and to me it looks exactly the same as what the NARS one does so if you get a brush like this in a in a um, in a bronzer or in a palette don't throw it away because it's actually quite good to do that nice crisp line for your um, contour to give you that nice crisp cut shape it really is really good for that because it just gives you a really nice defined line now while I've got this out I'm taking my beautiful red and black silk brush that I got from um, Royal and Lang Langnickel while I was at IMATS and I'm just going to take the shimmery highlighting powder and just put that across my cheeks then one of the other things you will have seen in my haul was from the Laura Geller um, Divine kit and this is the blush that was in it so this is bouquet and it's just this beautiful beautiful color so I'm just going to put some of this now because I'm a bit darker in skin tone I can afford to go a little bit heavier in the color but if you fair I would go really easy I would you know tap my brush in it and tap it on the back of my hand before I actually applied it to my face just to ensure that you don't get too much um, color in that so um, that is the my blush and my highlight done so really quite happy with those colors um, just never seem to be disappointed you know if you're going to buy some high-end products that they really just aren't going to disappoint um, now the last thing I'm going to do is lipstick this is one of the lipsticks that is in the um, Kat Von D lipsticks that I showed so now I cannot read the name of this because I don't have my glasses on but I will put it in the description bar so that you know what it is and I love these because they're mini and I love my lipsticks but let's be honest when they're this big very rarely do I go through a whole tube so I'm really stoked that these are so small so I'm just going to apply this now and I'll just move you down just a smidge so that you can see so this is a beautiful sort of pinky color if you can and of course can't talk when I'm applying lipstick so the color payoff on these is phenomenal absolutely amazing and I have to say they have a really amazing lasting power I have cheated and I have used a couple of these. They were too pretty not to. So I am just putting that on on its own and it's beautiful. The, I'm just going to bring you back up again. It's absolutely beautiful. The colour of this lipstick is 
it's sort of a beautiful plummy rose pinky color that I just 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 adore now the other thing I wanted to use was the um, I wanted to try this this is the lip gloss in City Lights from Laura Geller it goes with the the um, the luminous for eyes lips and face so I've got the luminous um, over the top of the foundation so this is the it comes with a um, brush not a doe foot applicator so I'm just going to pop some of this on this lipstick and I am going to brush wipe the brush off because it is stained pink and I do not want to stain this clear thing that's something I really really hate <laughs> I really hate that so just going to add this to the top as well just to add a bit of sparkle so it's definitely not a um, sticky lip gloss and it smells quite nice it's quite smoothing and of course I've got a hair surprise mm, I quite like it it has a smell don't think it has a hair's gone thank you don't think it has a um, flavor but it definitely has a smell to it so just making sure there's no lipstick on my teeth so as you can see it's given a really pretty um, really pretty glittery glow over the top of that lipstick that lipstick is stunning on its own but it's just beautiful with the the um, city lights over the top so this is my look so my eyes my skin the blush and the lipstick so basically all these videos together are just part of well are all items from the haul that I've just recently done so hopefully you know you've enjoyed seeing these being put to use I think my skin looks fabulous with the glow that it's got and that's even with the naked skin over the top again even though I've got foundation and powder and a primer on and then the um, the illuminating fa face over the top it certainly doesn't feel heavy at all uh, it feels quite light on my skin I don't feel like my skin's cakey or, or cloggy or anything one thing I haven't done is use my Scandinavia skin finish which I must do because I always do that and this will last all day so I should also do a quick outfit of the day just have these um, which you can probably hear clicking away in the background these silver leaf earrings wanted to pull a bit of purple in so I've just got these purple jelly earrings and these little crystal earrings that sort of change color I have no necklace on today I've just got a really flowy um, bat, bat wing top I'll just step back so you can see it so it's just sort of this foresty black should be for Halloween shouldn't it um, I just love these and I've got a sort of purpley colored um, singlet on underneath which I guess inspired the purple um, purpley plum sort of iron lip today and the hints of purple then I've just got um, one of my gas bracelets on a solid um, silver bracelet and a purple and silver um, little stretch bracelet as well so just to tie the purple in with you know my outfit and then I've just got black caprice pants on because um, it's coming into summer but it's weird today it's sort of a bit cool and then it gets hot and then it gets cool again so caprice pants are good for that so anyway hope you're all doing really really well hope you've enjoyed this little series of videos if you like these where I use the products that I haul um, broken down into little videos let me know um, I know you all want to see how the products work I hate hauls when you don't actually see what the products look like on the skin it's all very well to hear what they say and do but it's different to, to actually see it in action and I really like to see it and see how it works so hope you've really enjoyed this little haul and the little series that I've done and I will continue to do these if you've got any other ideas or anything else you'd like to see if you want me to do more looks using um, 
the Steeler in the Moment palette or anything like that, please let me know. Um, please leave your comments in the comment section. Please give me a thumbs up if you've enjoyed this video. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so because it really makes my day when I see that somebody's made a comment or thumbs up. I just love it. So take care of yourselves, whatever it is that you're doing. And I hope you're all keeping really, really well. See you soon. Bye.